right. We're rolling. Okay, Ben. Ben, who's the better cook? Oh, me. I for sure am. Uh, I guess I'll expand on that. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, well, I've made every single meal during college for her. Okay. So, yeah, I probably have more experience. By default, okay. Mm -hmm. Caitlin, I hope you agree. Um, what, what is, okay, this would be a Ben and Caitlin. Um, so what's Caitlin's favorite meal? And then what's your favorite meal? We actually had this question at our first week of when we met our mentor, her favorite food. And her favorite food is lasagna. Okay. And my favorite meal is probably steak okay. or ribs. Steak or ribs. Um, who's the better driver? Definitely me. <laughs> what would Caitlin say is your best quality? Ooh. Um. <laughs> I'm trying to think. Uh, I don't know. Not my patience. I can get impatient with driving. Uh, uh, maybe my thoughtfulness hopefully she likes my thoughtfulness <laughs> okay and what do you think caitlin's best quality is her best quality is probably just how her like genuine care for everybody and she wants everybody to be like comfortable and... oh way out caitlin okay um so we're gonna go with just caitlin on this one caitlin's um go-to non-alcoholic drink as well as her go-to alcoholic drink oh non-alcoholic drink would be Maybe just the bubbly. Okay. Bubbly. Um, More than coffee? Oh, actually, it's definitely Shoot. a coffee. Yeah, you ruined it. I ruined it. <laughs> Darn it. Okay. And? Um, her alcoholic drink would be... Ooh, oh, a carbless. Okay. It's like a seltzer. Okay. Um, what is your most memorable camping experience? Boulder Field. I feel like that'll be an easy, Hands unanimous down. Okay. decision. Okay. Um, do you want to explain Boulder Field or? All right. Caitlin For those explain? that don't know, we, it was our first, we went to Colorado last summer and it was our first hike of the trip and we were planning to summit Long's Peak, but there was a lot of snow on the mountain still. It was in June and it was, it was actually a really hard hike. I feel like that takes something for me to say, <laughs> but it was, and we were up there and it was actually like, it was a nice night. We were in our short sleeves. <laughs> And then we got uh, laid down for bed and the wind started to pick up and it got more and more and it started to get super cold. And then by like midnight, the tent started collapsing on us and Caitlin was a little teary. And <laughs> we have some good video. video. There's some good somewhere. videos, but yeah, it was probably the worst night of sleep I've ever got, but it's field. memorable. Um, okay, so dream vacations, Caitlin's. Uh, she wants to go to Costa Rica and see all the animals there and do all the hikes and stuff. Um, Ben's? Mm, I'd probably be like in Norway or Switzerland, do those hikes out there. Um, cleanest bathroom? Uh, <laughs> Caitlin. Um, who's most likely to say I'm sorry first? Um, I don't know. I feel like we can both be stubborn sometimes and think we're right. No. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe Caitlin. Um, let's see. Longest shower. Caitlin for sure. How many minutes? Uh, like fifteen. I'm probably like two or three. Okay. Um, what's one thing Caitlin can't live without? Can't live without. Oh, her pens. <laughs> what's one thing Ben can't live without? Uh, peanut butter. I knew you were gonna say that. Um, what did Caitlin wear on your first date and where did you go? I don't know. She makes don't know fun what of she me. Wore? She makes fun of me for this all the time. I don't know what she wore. Where'd you I, go? I don't know what our first date would like be considered. Like we went on like a couple dates, I guess. Like we went skiing, but we weren't like actually like I was just getting to know each other. And then she came back to school early before we started dating and we had a America uh, we stayed up until like midnight. And then we started reading. Watching Miracle? Yeah, we watched Miracle. Um, but then we went out one time to a restaurant and talked for a while. Uh, Sounds it was like downtown it's muddy. Brookings. Muddy the start. 
<laughs> yeah, it was a little muddy. You like gave three answers. I could, yeah. I don't know. I guess our first like official date would be a restaurant. It was like for her birthday. I don't remember what she was wearing. And then date? What was the date? We just went out to eat. Yeah, date. Like, date. Oh, month. probably like February 11th. Or something. Our date that we, I like asked her to be my girlfriend was February 18th. Uh, Caitlin's go-to song, karaoke. Karaoke, karaoke song. song? Well, is this going to be a question for me too? Sure. Uh, we sang Dixieland Delight by Alabama. Okay, let's check. Together. Um, Caitlin's happy place. Uh, the lake. Ben's. Mm, probably just like out on a hike or a run. Who's a better dancer? Out on a run, did you say? Who's a it's better a dancer? Place. Uh, better dancer. Okay, I'd probably say Caitlin, but there's an asterisk. She gave me a bloody nose when we were swing dancing. So Questionable. that kind of evens it out a little That's bit. True. Um, Caitlin's biggest phobia. Um, uh, biggest phobia. I'll go like a little more personal, but like not being liked. <laughs> not being liked. Ben's phobia. My phobia. Uh, oh, running down a road and getting a rock flung up, flung up into my eye. Has that happened? No, I remember I was talking about it. It was a high school camp and we started talking about that. And I feel like it's really realistic to happen. <laughs> oh my gosh. Who's the better archery shot? Uh, I'd say I'm more dialed. Okay. <laughs> um, whose laugh is most memorable? I'm that sure. one's an easy one. <laughs> She's probably laughing right now. <laughs> um, what is? Uh, what do you do that annoys Caitlin the most? Uh, lose things, forget things. Mm -hmm. uh, how about opposite? What's the thing that bothers me? Um, hmm. Smooth and quick. It's probably a good thing. <laughs> it's a hard one to come up with? Yeah. Oh, probably just her putzing. Like if we need to get going somewhere and she's normally not super prepared ahead of time. Yeah. Uh Caitlin's ideal date. Um I think she has a few, but I think one would just be just me and her on a walk, like a hike. Um, is that the same for you? Your ideal date? Yeah, I would like that. Um, ooh, who made the first move? Um, she'll say that she did, but she didn't. <laughs> <laughs> she, so, I don't know what, like, the first move is, like, what you're <laughs> defining it as, but, um... It's definitely you. Yeah, it's definitely me. <laughs> okay, last question. Who's going to be the first to cry at your wedding? Um, I don't know, she doesn't think I'm going to cry. Time will tell. I know she's going to cry. I think she will. So if I were to put money on it, I would say her. But the groom has to walk everyone down the aisle first. So that could be, we'll see. Actually, and I have a follow-up question I just thought of. So which mother is going to be the first to cry? Oh, which mother? Um, Caitlin's. Wow, that is saying something. You're not much of a crier. You'll get teary maybe a little bit. You're right. Okay. Um, Dad's going to cry? Uh, I bet both will get a little teary. Okay. All right. Anything else you want to add? Um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that was the full truth, and I stand <laughs> by my answers. All right. Thanks, Ben. Yeah.